With coronavirus now spreading from person to person within the UK, health officials are looking at a menu of options to delay the worst of the outbreak, including social distancing. That's minimising the contact between people. Moderate restrictions could include working from home and cancelling events with big crowds such as football games and concerts. More extreme measures could include quarantining towns or stopping public transport, just as the authorities did in the Chinese province of Hubei. So what impact would they have? Well, Sky News has commissioned exclusive research from the same team at Lancaster University that's helping the government plan its strategy. This is the rise and fall of cases that we might expect over the next few months with no action. But imposing moderate restrictions on social contact for four weeks could delay the epidemic to the summer and reduce the peak by 25%, easing the load on the NHS. Imposing the same restrictions for longer, eight weeks, would reduce the peak even more by 50%, with cases tailing off just as the autumn sets in an even bigger benefit for the health service. Finally, the academics looked at the more extreme approach of sealing off cities over eight weeks. And the effect was dramatic at first, reducing the peak by 80%. But once the restrictions were lifted, the computer model suggests there would be a second wave of cases and a higher peak just at the start of the winter flu season. It's a warning to Public Health England. Some restriction on social contact would help the NHS cope with peak demand, but too much, and it simply shunts the epidemic into next winter when hospitals will be stretched to capacity dealing with other illnesses.